um, Taliban was against the Marine, uh, was up against the um, Taliban. Uh, he had a, there was a bomb threat, explosive alert, and evacuation. Um, Signal everybody had to move away, far away from the Abbey Gate to survive the attack. So there's been like, they in Kabul, Afghanistan, therefore there's been a bombing in the hospital, bombing in the church, bombing in the school they built, and bombing at the airport while they were back. So the Taliban said two years later after the U.S. evacuated, were told to leave Afghanistan, uh, they won the war. They said U.S. service member, um, did not do nation building. They were victims of uh, physical body injuries, physical damage, personal injury. And uh, Sergeant Vargas, the Marine, said uh, he saw the Taliban killing other people. So he was right there uh, waiting for in the tunnel, and the explosive went off. And then uh, Hunter Lopez mounted. 13 Marines died, they were brave soldiers, they were heroes, they were victims of uh, the Taliban uh, opponent, offender. Uh, no explosives allowed at the airport, no guns allowed, no knife wounds allowed, uh, no drugs allowed, no trespassing allowed, restraining order. So I was wrongly arrested at Camp Pendleton, uh, I'd like to know. Uh, I need to be compensated for the unwanted towing six hundred fifty five thousand triple A and fifteen hundred lawyer because I want it. I want them to pay me back. I blame the campaign Pendleton <coughs> uh, military police for <coughs> for kidnapping me and making false arrests and putting handcuffs on me that's assault. <coughs> they take blood tests and fingerprint and photo, make me go to the locker, walk, <coughs> make you sit down, wait, and then the car is gone. Semper Fi, salute! Don't ever do that to me. You're gonna, I'm gonna file a lawsuit against you for wrongful arrest. I promise you.